this is the VKPO Russian military sixth layer, sixth layer of their eight layer clothing system that they have for, them, for their military. This is current issue. This is what they're wearing right now. And I have the fifth layer on right here, the pants. I did a review on that, very cool stuff. This is basically the equivalent of the Gen 3 United States military extreme cold weather gear. That's what they have. They have, they have an eight layer system I believe that the military has a six or seven layer system. But this is, if you're familiar with the Gen 3 extreme cold weather gear, the, the shell jacket that they have, um, this is basically the same thing, except the Russians. Make, this is the Russian gear version of it. Waterproof, windproof, snowproof, keeps the heat in, keeps you dry, keeps you warm. Now, they have a system, you know, they, this is, like I said, the sixth of eight layers. They have two other layers that can go over this. However, what we do here is this was like the top layer, and we layer underneath it and build up. You can do that as well because that's, I mean, it's, like I said, it's the same thing. But they have a bigger system that can go over it. Um, they have a, like a Gen 3 type or a Gen 1 type coat that's actually insulated and stuff too. Very cool. I don't have that, but like I said, this is their part of their arachnid system also as well. Uh, let's take a look at it. You have Velcro all the way down. You have an extra storm flap right here. Seals back over the zipper. Zipper opens up. See right here, it is seam sealed, basically their version of the Gore-Tex jacket, the Gen 3. It's all sealed, taped, seams taped, everything has this layer on the inside that is gives it the waterproofness and the uh, windproof. Very nice, very nice. It's got a hood with a little uh, visor on it. Even has a pull tab to cinch that hood down in the back to fit your head or helmet. Also has cinches right here to pull it tight around your neck. Very cool about this too though. It has the storm zippers that are sealable. Keeps them sealed. Little flap to go over that. Velcro adjustment right here on the wrist. A little bit of elastic right there, reinforced right through here on the elbows and arms. Rank tabs, Velcroed as well. Got a little loop right here as well. There's no outside pockets on this. There's no pockets like the Gen 3, the American version. So got the sticker on there when it came. But yep, very cool. Pants. Sent me the whole outfit. Russian cold camo. Very cool place. Much like the uh, extreme cold weather pants that the United States has. This is the exact same thing. Button, zipper right here. All of it is taped, seamed, sealed, even extra material right here for any repairs. Loops on it right here, pull, cinch it down, fit you, tighten it up. Reinforcement on the knees. Velcro adjustment on the ankle. I'll show you on this side here. Look at this. 
We have the same zipper on the side too, but it only goes up to about here on the American version. This one goes all the way up your thigh. Oh, it's got a little loop or a little flap there, extra seal it in. Goes all the way up your thigh. That way you don't gotta take off your boots because you're wearing this over your uniform underneath. Very cool, very cool system. Pockets right here, well there's no pocket. We'll talk about that in a little bit. It's pass through for your uniform. No back pockets. Like I said, this is just a shell. Reinforced seat. We're gonna put this on, we're gonna take a closer look right, at it. We're basically looking at it right now. Very cool system, very cool. Got this right here. Can cinch this down even further than I've got it, where it can really fit tight around your head. Like I said, it's got the little visor right here. Very cool system. What's cool about this, like I was showing earlier, the rain proof zippers, it's pass through. The pass through system. I'm not wearing the shirt, the, the, the layer five underneath it, not the top, because it's pretty warm out here. But uh, pass through, get to your uniform, your pockets, things like that. Just like on the Gen 3 of the, of the United States, the United States one. Just like that on both sides. And then you got this flap, of course, that goes over that one the Velcro. And elastic on the wrist. Very cool. Pants. Let me adjust it down here a little bit. Pants are the same way. Velcroed. But you can pass through to your pocket right here. Underneath, I'm wearing the gen, the, the layer five of theirs. So you can pass through to your pockets in your uniform, just like on the Gen 3. Very cool system. Like I said, it's got this flap right here. It covers that zipper. Keeps any rain and, and uh, wind out. Very nice system. Very nice. Got your Velcro cuffs right here. Velcro all the way. Look at this. Zipper. All the way up. Your uniform underneath. All your layers access. And it comes up this far. Instead of like so much so on the Gen 3 of the military uniforms. It comes all the way up to right your mid thigh since back down there you go you don't even have to take off your pants underneath you can just remove these without having to remove your boots things like right, that I'm just gonna do a quick insert right here with the jacket over the layer six over the layer five so I got my layer five hood right here got this hood right here you cinch that down, it's actually, this actually, this visor part right here actually comes out over that. So that gives you good protection there. Cinch that down, you'll be good to go. Also, I was gonna show you too though, it's on these rain zips, pass through right to the layer five or your uniform underneath. Very cool gear. This is a very cool system. This is the BK PO layer six of the Russian military gear. This is a current operation. Very cool EMR digital flora pattern. And like I said, this is the equivalent of the Gen 3 extreme cold weather gear layering system that we use this just happens to be the russian version of it so it's basically their version of the cortex jacket 
of the Gen 3 version, not the Gen 1, the Gen 3. Very cool system, very cool, made in Russia, made for their military from Russian cold camo. They have this stuff available right now, multiple sizes. Very good prices on this stuff. You know, I'm really liking the Russian gear. Much appreciated to those guys for sending this out for a review. This is awesome stuff. And it will keep you dry. It will keep the elements off you. It'll keep the wind off you. You layer this right now with however we do stuff here. Layers underneath, same kind of concept. They have one that even goes over this. They actually have two more layers that go over this. One is a huge, 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 big silver suit stuff, but that's like extreme Arctic Siberian conditions, you know. Uh, kind of funny looking, but it will keep you alive. The one that they had that goes over this, that's directly over this, is another digital flora pattern too. Thicker coat, thicker jacket, things like that. So it will keep you alive and keep you warm in extreme cold conditions. Very cool gear, very nice stuff. And I'm impressed with the Russian stuff. I mean, it's as built as good as ours. It's the, the material, the sewing, everything is nice. It's nicely done on it, solid gear. Solid gear, it'll work just as good as any of our stuff. So, and it's got to, I mean, that's, they're, you know, it's Russia. I mean, their, their military is well outfitted and well, well maintained and, and um, all that. So they have good stuff. So anyway, that's my video on this. Very cool piece of gear. This is the VKPO layer six on this one. So very cool gear, very cool. Keep it heavy.